the uh, the Vatican, the Pope, um, they've basically abandoned this Hong Kong cardinal. Yeah. And I need to sort of get into the ins and outs here. It's a little bit nerdy. All the references are available at loudoutcredit.com, where they have uh, signed a deal. And I, I, they've signed a deal with the devil and what they have done with China, the Vatican. So let me set this up. In Hong Kong, you have uh, Cardinal Joseph Sen. He's on trial for why assisting pro-democracy protesters during the 2019 demonstrations. You would think this is a good thing. Here's a clip. After the Hong Kong national security law was passed, the Cardinal was arrested in May for his role as a trustee in a relief fund known to help pro-democracy protesters who participated in the 2019 demonstrations in Hong Kong. Cardinal Zen is well known for his outspoken calls for change in China. Uh, as all believers, uh, we must be He's optimistic. A Justin but, Bieber uh, fan. Doesn't mean that uh, uh, we can uh, <laughs> hope Bieber. in uh, immediate success, uh, uh, because uh, every uh, relation uh, depends on two parts. Uh, and now, if uh, China doesn't change uh, its policy, uh, there's nothing we can expect. All six of the defendants, including Cardinal Zen, have pleaded not guilty. The trial is set to last until September 23rd, and if found guilty, the cardinal could face serious fines or jail time. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure he's going to face fines or jail time. He's going to yeah. face disappearance time. Yeah, exactly. And just to be clear, before, because I, I get it, and, and Catholics, it's not lost on me that you've been the whipping post for a lot of the media and the entertainment. I understand it. I get why you're touchy. But just see where we're coming from. I'm saying that guy, <laughs> brass balls, that guy's a cardinal. Yeah. Where's the, ca where's the cavalry coming over the hill for that guy? Because I think that guy actually has something to lose and not the guys in the red stupid shoes. They deserve the support. If we're talking about Christianity, and let's, let's use the term Catholic, Catholic Christianity interchangeably. I understand the denominational difference here. If we're talking about spreading the gospel throughout the world, the Catholic Church and the Vatican should make it their raison d'etre to help that man who has a brass pair of balls. I'm supporting him. Which is why I am furious with the Vatican and this Pope. And if you're honest with yourself, you are too. So this guy is accused of setting up an illegal fund to pay the legal costs of those uh, arrested. Not like Kamala Harris, who yeah, helped close. with uh, you know the rioters who right. burned down Walgreens. I don't think this guy burned down. Uh, no, 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 no. Walgreens. Burn Believers Walgreens. don't do that. Yeah. So he's being prosecuted <laughs> under the same <laughs> law used to target the triad. Yeah, exactly. Which is super strange, right? So racketeering was a charge that they brought up so that they could take care of gangsters and mobsters. So that basically, this is like charging the Archbishop of L.A. with racketeering, even though he did no racketeering. Yeah, right. So he's Cardinal makes, Capone. They're making up laws. They're like, oh well, this worked for gangs. I mean, he. Set up a defense fund and he wears a funny kind of hat. So, yeah, let's put him in there. Yep. That's exactly like what it is. And by the way, the Pope, Vatican, nowhere to be found. No. Not a peep. How is that not infuriating? To every single Catholic out there across the world, we've called men to the mat. We've yeah. called non-denominational Christians to the mat on prosperity gospel. Tons of pastors we've to the mat. We've called tons of pastors to the mat. Yep. Hey, pastors to the mat. Where are all the Catholics? And certainly where are those with the giant rooms full of gold? So when Zen was arrested, <laughs> this was all the Vatican said. Non-committally, I might add. But that's just, mm -hmm. that's, that's me. You and, yeah. Well, that's me, I'm adding. That's, I'm editorializing. <laughs> but you'll see why. The Holy See has learned with concern the news of Cardinal Zen's arrest and is following the development of the situation with extreme attention. Oh, good to break, good to break your gaze from the 12-year-old boy. <laughs> That's the only one. That's the only one I'll do. Maybe two more. So, I have a question for you that? right here. I like that. <laughs> why is the Vatican? This is the, why are they silent? This should be like catnip yeah. for the Vatican. Hey, you have a cardinal who's out there doing the Lord's work, who's pro-democracy, right? You guys have taught, you guys, the, Vat the Pope is supportive of Black Lives Matter. Hey, this guy is actually facing persecution. And I don't mean that in the way that people say about, you know, South Americans just fleeing shitty socialist governments. That's not actual persecution. This guy could be accidentally disappeared for what he's doing. This should be a layup for the Vatican to say, we stand with our own. We stand with those who are spreading the gospel. So, I'm asking you why. I think I have an answer. Yeah. Pretty good answer. Leading, yeah. leading the witness. Yeah. So, in 2018, the Vatican signed a very shady agreement, again, editorializing with mm. Beijing. And it had some provisions, including 
that the Vatican recognized seven Chinese bishops appointed without the Vatican's approval, that the Vatican can only pick bishops from a pool selected by the Communist Chinese Party. And by the way, that's up for renewal in October. This, this agreement is. This agreement. Yeah. And here's something else. Just to be clear, um, in China, Hong Kong, you may not know this, only a communist Chinese party version of the Bible is even allowed. Right. That's been rewritten. It's a crime to have a Bible that isn't approved. And it has. It's been rewritten. There are a lot of parts that have been changed. And by the way, I don't. it's a really weird ad in there in Revelation where it says, <laughs> and behold, a, a, a Mao on a horse. Yeah. I don't think that was in there. It's just, it's, yeah. Well, behold, it's the red horse. Behold a yellow so, horse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. My point, look, take it up with the communist Chinese people. My point is this. The Vatican is signing a deal with a country that doesn't even allow its citizens to have the Bible. Yeah. Hey, how about this? I would be, and I'm going to use some profanity here. My stance would be, if I'm the international representing uh, governing body of Christianity, uh, uh, a f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-f-